What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the back nine out here at the Scrapyard in Charlotte, North Carolina. We are throwing three discs today and I am stoked on them. The Orbit Moonshine Felon. This does not fly like a felon. You guys will see that. If you watch the front, you will know that. Um, great disc, doesn't fly like a felon. So I'm still trying to figure it out mentally uh, since I've thrown felons for so long. Um, Lucid Ice Orbit Escape. I'm really excited to throw this disc more. Um, incredibly excited to throw this disc more. I think this is gonna be my like straight tunnel shot um, that's not a stag. As it beats in and I need to throw it further than a stag, then this will be the disc that I go to. Really excited for it. Um, and then the Tristan Tanner Honor. Um, this is, I mean, I love all the glory or all the royal line plastic. So it's feeling good. We're gonna, we're gonna put some work in here um, and see how we can do on the back nine. Okay, so this hole off the tee is actually great for both the honor and the felon. Gonna aim at the trees on the right with Annie and have them stable out and flatten towards the basket. That's the whole goal. 326 feet, so I gotta, I gotta kinda pump these. See if we can get this down there. Don't stable up yet. Oh, too early. Okay, too early on that. So felon, I still wanna give it some height maybe a little bit more ante. And I'm not gonna throw the escape here because it's not a hole that I would throw it on. Yes, now stable. Dude, that thing was... <sighs> All right, so the honor actually flew pretty good there. If it had held its Anheuser for a little bit longer, then it would have been in a really good spot. My step put has not been feeling good lately, so I'm just gonna putt this. Why did you throw that on Heiser? Oh, well, I mean, both of them were close. All right. Okay, so this hole is way too straight to throw, honestly, either the honor or the felon on. I might try throwing the honor, but oof, I don't know that I want to. Um, 300 feet, typically I throw my stag on this nice and easy or like a bounty or something. I'm gonna throw the escape and we're gonna try and ace run this thing down there, okay? Because it's a fast disc, so why not just commit to it? <laughs> Let's see how straight we can get this thing to fly. I mean, that's an ace run. I just hit the chains. Oh my goodness. And then I saw it flash left. Oh my gosh. Why? Dude, how did I catch chains and go this far past? Oh my gosh. From ace to par. Nah, you can get this. Really? Oh my gosh, guys. Oh, that's the first time I've ever almost aced this one or chained out on it. That's wild. That was so sick. I don't even know which one of these I did first, but there's the par for us. Wow, that was so sick. Okay, so this, uh, this hole, I typically throw a diamond on a backhand. So obviously we don't have anything similar to that. We'll try throwing these up there, but there's, there's no way that this is the play on this hole, um, honestly. Like, I, I, yeah, the only thing that I could think of throwing here is maybe this escape on a forehand, which we haven't done yet. So I'll try and throw the escape on a forehand. Maybe it stands up a little bit around the corner. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I would have loved to have been able to show you guys that. I think that was gonna work really nice. Um, but typically, what I'd throw here is, is this diamond on a little turnover. That's an ace run all day. <sighs> Man. All right, so this is just going to be a little felon up shot. Maybe a felon throw in. Let's see. Is that high? Dive in. Way past the basket. <laughs> 
So the diamond, I mean, it's was, it was probably pretty close to an ace run, even though it's all the way back here. It was on such ante that I don't doubt it. Probably came in maybe like around here. But this felon, I was trying to throw it in. So obviously we pushed deep. I don't even really have a putt now. That's a bad putt. That's a good putt. That's a bad putt. <laughs> this hole isn't really designed to show off these discs, so I'm not too bothered by that. So this hole is 325 and it's fairly downhill. Um, typically, I'd throw a putter on this. It's fairly neutral, like my uh, Keystone, but the only thing we have here that I think will work on this is the escape and I'm trying to figure out how to throw it because I don't want to just pop it on hyzer. We'll just feel it out, see what we can do. Oh, that's bad. Because I'm trying to baby it because this isn't like this hole isn't designed for any of these discs either. All right, so if I can throw this moonshine felon through this gap on a little bit of Annie, should give us a par putt. Oh my. You think that was a little bit of Annie? Dude, that's, it's, I was thinking that was a normal felon. Oh my gosh. All right. Let's see if we can make this one nice and easy. Finish your stroke. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's what I thought was gonna happen. Nice. All right, saving the par on that score. I'm literally haven't kept the score this whole time, but par on this hole is not too bad, especially with, with those discs. All right, so this hole is actually perfect for the escape. Um, so we'll grab this and throw it. I want to throw it a little bit flat and have it work its way around to the right, but either that or like a high, high hyzer. I'll do a high kind of slight hyzer here. Oh yeah, that should be good. Get past all of them. Oh, that's a bummer, dude. That felt so good. All right, now the felon I'm going to throw out on Annie, and I bet you this does like, this could be really good. I didn't throw that. Oh, I kind of did. Oh, dude. Please? Uh, yeah. I don't think that's parked, but I mean, it should be pretty close. And then the honor, I'm gonna try and throw flat at one of these trees and try and cut right in front of it. Oh, that was bad, but. Okay, that might actually be a putt. So I'm bummed because the escape was actually the one that I thought was gonna do the best here. And the other two are 10 feet. So we'll just throw our putters up there like that. So the escape would be a par of the other two, which again, surprisingly enough, worked really well here. So the felon was right here, which is solid. Man, that was so good, what in the world? And then the honor is right here. So honestly, two out of three birdies on this one with these discs and, and I birdied it with what I didn't expect. It's pretty cool. I'm about that. Okay, so typically I throw a backhand on this um, hole, but I can do that with any of the discs that we have. Um, so I'm gonna throw a, I'm gonna scoot you guys over as far as I can. I'm gonna throw this honor. I'm gonna try and throw it flat and straight. See what we can do with it. That's why I don't throw forehands on this hole, man. I'm so bad at it. I, I love the touchy backhand on this one. 
All right, felon. Inside of that, please. All right, and then the escape, I think I can throw on a hyzer. I think it'll flip up. Kind of. <laughs> That's funny. So for the honor, I would just throw the honor again. Go in the basket. Oh my, <laughs> bro, that was literally parked and it catches edge and rolls down the hill, I'm dead. All right, felon. I expect a par on this hole whenever I throw a forehand, honestly, so. Okay, so this hole, actually we can throw all three of these on. Um, the escape, I'm gonna try and throw flat through the gap. Trusting that it'll push straight and then flip. So try and throw this flat here. Oh my word, that was terrible. All right, the felon, we're gonna give some Annie. What in the world? Okay, I didn't hear any trees, so that could be parked. And then the honor, we're gonna try and throw the exact same, but I'm gonna actually try and hit the gap. I missed it on that last one. Mm. Dang. Yo, those, I played those earlier, and those bricks are fine. These, like, I am, I do not feel comfortable putting my foot down right there. I was very insecure. All right, so I'm just gonna throw a touchy little backhand maiden shot here. Yep, that's a putt. So the honor actually gave us a putt here. Oops, which is surprising. I don't see the felon yet, but I think that it's up there somewhere. All right. Go in. That's a bummer. That was a sick putt. No, that first one was perfect. Dang. Yeah, so I didn't even see it right here. Not too bad. Okay. So the felon, honestly, I feel like I li I'm liking it more on backhands than I am on forehands, which is strange because I've always wanted a felon that I like to throw on backhand. Okay, so this hole is made for a couple of these discs. Um, take the honor, throw it out on Annie. Nice and easy, don't wanna to push too far down there. Um, and have it stable up around the corner, hopefully. No trees, of course. But depending on where that landed, a, a big turnover with the escape could be the birdie look. All right, felon, same sort of thing. Oh yeah. That flies just like a beat in felon. Like I'm starting to like it. It just took a while for me to understand it. Okay, so this is kind of a bummer. Um, I'm gonna see if I can find the felon and maybe throw from it because throwing the turnover with the escape here I don't think would be good. Okay, so actually with where the felon is, I wouldn't even throw this escape. I'm gonna have two forehands from over there. Um, and you know what? Just for the sake of watching this fly, we're gonna move this right here because we're trying to show off these discs. <clears throat> And I'm gonna give this some, some serious height. We're gonna see what it'll look like on a, on a big sky, Annie. Nah, I'm not beating it enough. Okay. Once the thing gets beat in, that'll be a sick shot for it. All right, so from here, I'm going to throw both of these, the felon and the honor. 
I don't think I'm going to go through here. It's a little tight. I think I'm going to go sky and see if we can get them up there to a good spot. Now stable up. Oh, it looks good. Come on. Oh my gosh, dude. That looks so good. All right, felon. That one wasn't good. Dude, and it just holds that. That thing is so crazy. It's a little bit of a bummer. Um, because that was gonna be so good. All right, if there was any hole out here to forehand these on, it'd be hole 18. 312, throw the honor flat, let it do its thing. What is with these bugs right as I'm about to throw? That should be sick though. Yeah, that should be parked. The bugs are like, hey, what's in your ear right as you're about to throw? You are, leave me alone. All right, felon flat, which is crazy on this hole. Typically you're th throwing a felon on a chop, on a chop shot, but I think throwing it flat here and straight, it's gonna, it's gonna push really nice. All right, turn it over a little bit. But look at that thing. It's so crazy how that literally does not fly like a felon. Man, why don't we see what the escape would do here? Nice and easy flat flick. This should have some fun movement on it. Stood up a little. Because I threw it so easy, it didn't have time to push. So besides the time I aced this hole, this is probably the closest that I've ever gotten. Which is pretty sick. And I think that the felon is somewhere over here. Yeah, in, in freaking snake territory. No thank you. Toss this up real quick. Go in? No. Savage. Um, so yeah, the, the felon, flippier than I thought. Way, and it's weird to say flippy, but I guess it's not flippy, it's just not stable might be the correct term. All right, so that's gonna be it. Um, the escape, I'm actually really excited for. I need to go to a different course where I can like actually throw it a little bit more. Maybe go to Eastway or Renaissance, something like that. Have some fun with it. Um, the Felon is a good disc. It feels incredible, but man, it's going to take work to disassociate it with Felons because it doesn't fly like a Felon. Like, it's, it's weird. You guys saw that. Um, and then the Honor, pretty good. I actually like it. And it's consistent. Feels really good in the hand. Uh, I like the plastic a lot, so... Yeah, thank you guys for hanging out. See you later.